Welcome to my channel Expat Barbados and today's video we are going to be talking about how I make friends and have made friends here in sunny Barbados. Yeah. My name is Jay and I help you make the move to Barbados in a way that suits you, your needs and your interests. So, if you want to find your tribe, then keep watching till the end of this video to unlock the keys to my six tips. My first tip is join a Barbados Facebook group. There are plenty to choose from. Andromeda Botanical Gardens. We're on a tour. We'd love you, Sharon. All right, then. I'll see what that looks like in my handiwork. This is the only black owned botanical garden here in Barbados. They are great for information, for activities, and for lots of opportunities to meet up with similar minded people. Wow. So we've planted more milkweed, we've got more seedlings, about 700 odd, uh, to try and get the balance so that we always have milkweed for the butterflies. But there's the caterpillar there. Bayesian cherry tree seeds. The Bayesian cherry, yeah. Yeah. All you need, vitamin C, you see one of these. Yes. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Wow. And even more important, to meet people who are actually living here. You don't, you can't tell the difference until you, until you taste one against the other. That's the size of seven yes. She hooks it up. Yes. Wow, that is super good. Okay, so one project. Hey, look, hey, look, good. Okay, okay. From this event, we were invited to other events. The Barbados Hiking Association is a very active group. We are the parish of St. Thomas, as you know, St. Thomas Performance. Yes. Beautiful location for hiking. Yes. We have any location for here. Fortunately for us, we have the number one trail ball to do this afternoon. The guy who makes sure everything goes smoothly. Never a dull moment. It's important that you they have regular Sunday walks both in the morning and also in the afternoon they have a fantastic schedule and every parish on the island is covered we found our fellow hikers to be very helpful very friendly and very welcoming so we just passed through Welshman Hall Gully up the road. Yes, and we're getting done. I don't know this area. Uh huh. But we're going when we get down to the bottom. Yes. Of this area, we're supposed to be in Bell Plain. In Bell Plain. Yeah. Wow, it's beautiful. Absolutely stunning. And we've got a great afternoon because the weather's nice. Yes, and sunny. And yeah, cool. and cool. <laughs> Choose a hike to suit your level, your ability, and don't forget to spend some time getting to know your fellow hikers. My second tip is to make sure that you go to your local restaurants and bars and cafes and shops. Hi everybody, another beautiful night. Yes, another beautiful night. Here in Spice Town. Well, six men yes. near Spice Town. <laughs> the rum bars are the best place to get authentic Bayesian food and drink at great prices and with great company. And a great opportunity to learn how to play dominoes, Bayesian style. I have found everybody so far in Barbados to be very friendly. 
that is locals and expats as well as tourists. So use that opportunity to speak to people and find out what you have in common. Right. Cheers. Cheers. Yeah, happy holiday. Right, happy holiday. <laughs> Honey goat cheese. Right. And then there's um, hummus. Um, Wait, are you um, saying that you were... Yeah, I guess. Oh, I didn't realize you were here. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Thank, okay. You so thank you so much. much. Thank you. So, so much. Maybe like the yeah, that's lovely. Yeah, that's lovely. Okay, so it's next to the Orange Street grocer and it's opposite the bakery. Thank you, that's great. Thank you, thank you. Oh, this looks nice. Beach bars or restaurants are very popular, particularly at sunset. They make the world so hot every day, people are dying. Walking is a very popular activity, particularly for locals. Beautiful, thank you, Coda. <laughs> my motivator, she keeps my pace up. I'm telling you, <laughs> I'm moving like 100 miles an hour, <laughs> getting my steps in before seven o'clock. <laughs> Look at this, fresh from the tree. <laughs> oh yes. Um, they're protected, so oh, they're protected. across the island is actually protected. When we went to Cherry Tree, we walked through the mahogany. Yeah, you Trees. Have to get permission to cut them down. Right, yeah. We're at Farley Hill today. It's been a walk uphill. It's been lovely. Very pleasant. Very quiet, peaceful. This is where they used to have the reggae concerts. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that looks great. You can see that old. Set up the stage there. These mahogany trees are protected. There we go. There we go. So, what's that area in the distance? So, you've got St Andrews over there. Try to find other people who may be interested to walk. It's a great way to explore the island and increase your fitness. Now, I've got to focus. Let's go up these hills. like the end of the earth. <laughs> Woo. Walking is a great way to meet people. Just remember to say hello. My fourth tip is to, you guessed it, find your local beach yes find your local beach community hello so i'm here again for another <laughs> bad exercise with yeah alia <laughs> she's here again guess what we're doing this morning we are going to be doing some it's like a bit exercise, isn't it? Wind weight. <laughs> so it's a heavy duty. And then we're going to do, yeah, swimming. swimming. Yeah, I'm uh, learning Jackie, to swim Jackie again. <laughs> I'm not, I'm learning to swim again from scratch. <laughs> from scratch. Swimming and exercising are great ways to meet people at the beach. Yeah, 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 yeah. What we do the motivation and inspiration, we do the perspiration. Yeah, well, there was a lot of perspiration this morning, but I'm telling you, with them weights, I nearly died. <laughs> I caught them all. Those are the weights. Here she goes. Right, 
right, Peddy, how have I been getting on with all my working out and exercise? Well, you've been doing quite well. You're a good shooter. Oh, that's nice to know. I'm very pleased. Yeah, so tell us, what, what do we do at the beach? Well, we have some fun and, and some exercise here. And S-E-A, -E, safe, enjoyable aquatics. So that's what we have. Yes. Fun at the beach, exercise and fun all goes together in one good package. Exactly. And that's why my swimming's got so much better. And it's all down to you why I'm swimming. I can't believe it. Woo -hoo! Woo -hoo! Because you've been a good student. Yeah, well, thanks. The great thing about the beach is that there are so many things to do. Three. We've got yoga on these body boards. That's take down word dog upward. Yeah, down with dog. <laughs> yeah. People generally say hi to each other at the beach, and this is the best time to actually get to know people, to start a conversation. Often it could be just a simple conversation about your accent and where you're from, and you will be amazed how many people that you will meet in this way. Read a book or just relax and enjoy the beautiful surroundings. Every beach has something special to enjoy. Every activity allows you the opportunity to engage with others and this I have found has been the best way to make friends here on the island. My fifth tip is to join a club. Make a list of your hobbies or the things you enjoy doing and then look for a group to join. This is Antoinette. Oh my God, Antoinette, you're amazing. Better, better on your camera, I think sometimes you don't realise how good they are. There are some great choirs on the island. My sixth tip is to find the local events in your community. <laughs> local community events are often a wonderful opportunity to meet local people, local businesses. The Six Men's Christmas concert was fantastic.
The St. James annual garden party was also a fabulous event. And would you believe it, I met one of my subscribers there as well. What a wonderful, wonderful day we had. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and share and subscribe. Mr. Creator. Oh.